What a matchup we've got for you. The ACC Big Ten Challenge presented by Dick Sporting Goods, the showcase game of this event, Dick. Number six, Michigan State, number one, Duke. The Big Ten may be on the verge of winning this event for the second year in a row after the ACC won the first ten challenges between these two conferences. Love the way Duke players catch the ball and immediately are in triple threat position. Irving dumps it down. Mason Plumley lays it in. You saw him have an incredible game against Marquette last week. A smaller look lineup now for Michigan State. Thornton is a former walk-on. Has actually started three games this year. Wide open Irving. Can't allow him to shoot the ball. That is one of the premier diaper dandies in America. He has lived up to every billing coming out of St. Patrick's High School in Elizabeth. Thornton trying to take it the distance. Irving the block. And missing the follow is Summers. Now watch right now, the great defensive effort in transition. There he is with the left hand, great timing. See, this Duke team plays much faster than the team did last yeah. year. And that guy is a big reason why. Irving, a, a great blend of size and terrific speed. Single to miss, Mason Plumley in traffic. A clean block, what a steal by Irving. He is every bit as good as advertised and better. He was brilliant in the CBE Classic. Brilliant. He got the MVP. There's the rebound. Plumley gets a block. Ball's going to pop in the hands. And there's Irv. He's very strong. He gives you a long, lean body, but he's a lot stronger than what he looks. Mike Krzyzewski recently surpassing 800 wins at Duke, closing in on 900 overall as Irving does it again. He is such a special talent. Irving, he sees a seam, left-handed layup. What can he do? We have seen him utilize the left hand, the right hand, medium range, jump shot. 874 wins right now for Mike Krzyzewski. That is fourth all-time in Division I in history. If they have a phenomenal year, he's actually got a chance to catch or pass Bob Knight this year, but more likely it'll be next season. Well, if he duplicates what he did last year, right. 35, he does 35 this year. I tell you, with the way that kid's playing, they got a shot. Lucas. Rebound Irving, numbers for Duke. And a block is called. Kalen Lucas called for the foul. Let's check in down court side with Doris Burke. Rowe, and another turnover. He was up in the air. You don't want to be able to nice bounce pass. Created off the pass by Irving. It's the Irving show. Lucas blocked by Irving. He's doing it all. Look at the slam by Draymond Green. That's big news for them because Draymond was a non-factor in that first half. Irving draws the foul. You see him go coast to coast. There's the run for Duke over the last three minutes. Green, Sherman switches hands, misses the left-handed layup. What a great look by Green. I can see why Digger Phelps loves him. Irving draws the foul. What we're hearing is Mason Plumley could return tonight as the tough layup goes for Irving. He returns, I'll tell you that. What a gem he is to the basket. Look at this kid handle the ball. Are you serious? Are you serious? Come on now. How good is this kid? Jason Williams, I know you're watching. What do you think, my friend? Oh, he is special. I want to hear Jay and Hubert and Digger. Duke will extend its non-conference home winning streak to 81. With an 84 to 79 win here tonight, Kyrie Irving has got a right to be pumped up. The freshman had an incredible night, 31 points, leading Duke to the victory.